Hi, I am Basavaras Tonugatti from basunivesh.com and in this video I will show you how to calculate maturity amount and return of LIC policies. What is IRR? It is the function in Excel sheet used to calculate the return on your investment when you make some investments in periodic ways. For example, your life insurance yearly premium. Before proceeding further, let us first understand few points. The first one is any amount that goes from your pocket will be considered as negative value for calculation. The second point is any amount you receive from investment will be considered as positive value for calculation. The third and most important point is IRR is used only when you have a periodic cash flows but not irregular. For example, your LIC premium which you pay regularly. Now let us calculate the return on investment from these LIC policies or typical endowment plans. For this purpose, I will take the first example of endowment plans and I have chosen the LIC's new endowment plan table number 814 for this purpose. As I considered as 30 years, term 20 years sum assured 5 lakh premium mode yearly and premium will be rupees 24,642 this is a premium what you will pay from your pocket so we have to enter this in a negative value that is minus 24,642 from first year the term is 20 years so you pay the premium up to 20 years so I will enter the same value up to 20 year now on 21st year it means once the policy completes 20 years in the beginning of 21st year the policy holder will receive the sum assured plus bonus plus final additional bonus according to this particular plan feature now how we can calculate the bonus calculation let us consider rupees 50 as a bonus for this particular plan for rupees 1000 sum assured per year so in this case your sum assured is 5 lakh then we have to calculate it for 5 lakh this is what I did here total bonus per year will be rupees 50 that is the bonus declared by this insurance company per year per thousand sum assured but our sum assured is 5 lakh so I multiply it by 5 lakh divided by thousand that is the answer will be rupees 25,000 this is your yearly bonus what you will get it now the term is 20 years so we have to multiply it by 20 so the answer will be 5 lakh apart from this you will also receive the final additional bonus final additional bonus is the one time payment what insurance companies will pay you at maturity or at death claim I consider the fair value of final additional bonus of LIC that is rupees 100 per thousand for more than 2 lakh sum assured policies with a term of 20 years. The final additional bonus is basically depends on the sum assured you opted and the term of the policy. Now let us calculate this for 5 lakh that is rupees 100 the final additional bonus but this 100 rupees is for 1000 rupees of sum assured but in our case it is 5 lakh sum assured so I am multiplying it by 5 lakh divided by rupees 1000 that is rupees 50,000 this is what you will receive at maturity from this new endowment plan let us enter it in 21st year as you will receive the rupees 5 lakh as sum assured plus rupees 5 lakh 
as bonus calculation what you did plus rupees 50,000 that is final additional bonus. So total you will receive 10 lakh 50,000 at the end of the 20th year from this plan. Now let us calculate the return. To do this one there are two ways to calculate. The first one is you have to go to formulas then insert function. Here you have to select IRR function. If you are not able to see that you, then you can type it here. Then click on go. Here you will find IRR. You select it and then now you have to enter the values. The values will be from first year of policy period till the maturity amount you received. Click on OK. The answer is 6.75 percentage of return. The other way to do it is directly entering the values. I will delete it and I will put it equal to IRR bracket enter the values that is select from the first year of your insurance premium payment to till maturity amount close the bracket enter the return from this insurance policy will be 6.75 now let us take another example that is single premium insurance plan here what you will do is you will pay a lump sum in the beginning of the policy year only but you will get the maturity amount only at the end of the policy term. For this purpose I considered LIC single premium endowment plan table number 817. Again I took that same example like 30 years of age term 20 years sum assured is 5 lakh and in this case it is premium mode will be single as it is a single premium endowment plan and the premium what you pay at once will be rupees 2,58,675 that I will enter it here. This is negative value because you are paying from your pocket. 2,58,675 Now from second year onward to till the maturity period of this policy you will not pay anything so I will put it 0 0 from second year onward to till policy period according to this policy at maturity that is on 21st year or else beginning of 21st year you will receive the sum assured what we opted for that is 5 lakh plus 5 lakh bonus that's what we calculated earlier considering rupees 50 per thousand sum assured and the same I will consider for example purpose and this is fair value of bonus what I can say plus rupees 50,000 bonus a final additional bonus so the value will be 10 lakh 50,000 that's what you will receive at the end of the 20th year or beginning of the 21st year let us calculate the return on investment I'll put it directly equal to IRR bracket select the values from first year to till the maturity amount close the bracket enter the return on this investment will be 7.26 now let us take another example this is another type of a endowment plans what insurance companies will offer for this purpose I will take the recently launched LIC G1 lab table number 836 I consider the age of the policy holder as 30 years in this case term of the policy will be 21 years but you are paying the premium only for 15 year from 16 year onward to till 21st year you will not pay anything the sum assured will be 5 lakh, premium mode will be yearly, premium will be 
27902 so let us enter it from first year minus 27902 till the 15th year because this is a limited premium payment policy and you will pay up to 15th year from 16th year onward to till the policy period that is up to 21st year you will not pay anything that is the reason i am entering the values as 0 0 up to 21st year on 22nd year or else in the beginning of the 22nd year you will receive the sum assured plus bonus accrued bonus plus final additional bonus bonus and final additional bonus calculation is already explained to you so i don't think it is required again and again so, so at the beginning of 22nd year or else end of the 21st year you will receive 10 lakh 50000 from this policy let us calculate the return equal to irr bracket enter the values from the first year to till maturity amount you will receive close the bracket enter so the return from this product will be 6.51 now let us take another type of endowment plans example that is money back plans again for this purpose i will take the example of lic's new money back plan that is 20 years term plan table number 820 a is, is considered as 30 years of a policy holder term is 20 years sum assured is 5 lakh premium mode is yearly premium is 38563 here in money back plan you receive 20 percentage of sum assured once the policy period complete 5 years that is in the beginning of 6th year and again in the beginning of 11th year one more 20 percent of sum assured you will receive as a survival benefit and on 16th year beginning you will again receive 20 percent of sum assured and finally at maturity you will receive 40 percent of sum assured plus bonus plus final additional bonus now let us enter the values minus 38563 this you will pay up to 50 year on 60 year you pay insurance premium but insurance company will pay survival benefit as you opted for money back plan so let us enter it minus 38563 what you pay from your own pocket as a insurance premium and insurance company will pay you the survival benefit that is 1 lakh rupees 20% is of 5 lakh is 1 lakh so on 6th year you have a positive cash flow of 61437 on 7th year onward again you pay the regular premium that is 38563 this premium payment will be up to 10th year in the 11th year again you receive 1 lakh survival benefit from insurance company and at the same time you pay rupees 38563 as a annual premium so the cash flow will be 61437 that is 1 lakh minus 38.38563 again from 12th year onward you will pay 38563 as a regular premium to 15th year on 16th year you again receive 1 lakh 
as a survival benefit minus thirty eight thousand five six three as a premium amount what you pay from your pocket so the left out part will be sixty one four three seven on seven. Tenth year onward, you again pay the regular premium thirty-eight thousand five six three up to policy period that is twentieth year. On twenty-first year, you receive forty percentage of sum assured. That is, in this case, it is two lakh plus. Five lakh as a bonus, which I took as an example of rupees fifty per thousand sum assured per year over the total policy period. Plus fifty thousand as final additional bonus. So. at the end of the policy period or else in the beginning of the 21st year you will receive 7 lakh 50000 from this plan now let us calculate the return equal to irr bracket consider the values from the policy first year to till the last maturity amount you receive close the bracket enter so this is 4.06 percentage of return or irr of 4.06 from this money back plan thanks for watching this video i hope you enjoyed this